Hey viewers, and welcome back to Let's Play Wing Commander Saga, The Darkest Dawn. When we last left off, the Hermes actually is hopefully back up to full strength now when it comes to fighters and bombers. But first, new user tip of the day, ejecting right before the Kilrathi destroys your fighter typically means you have about 10 more seconds to live. In fact, there are specifically Kilrathi aces that enjoy shooting escape pods for target practice. Sweeney! Second ship watch standards. Prepare to assume the watch. Thank you, Sweeney. Let's see what's next, shall we? Oh. This is Vice Admiral Rumley, commander of the Vega Sector fleet. At ease. We are now deploying the new F-103 Excalibur fighters to the front lines, of which several squadrons have recently entered service. The Hermes received a reinforced squadron of the Excaliburs, the new 912th Space Superiority Squadron, the Galahads. General Taggart's operation just concluded in the Alcor system. Declassified details, sent to every carrier in the fleet, indicate that the Victory just rescued a Dr. Severin, a demolitions expert whose knowledge is applicable to a second Confederation Doomsday project. Our next plans are to lay the groundwork for the deployment of this weapon. Shining Excaliburs. The failure of the Behemoth has illustrated that we can't expect to employ a strategic weapon without first clearing the path of hostiles. Therefore, before we deploy this new Doomsday weapon, Command has ordered that several systems along the front be securely in Confederation hands before operations proceed. That means the chances of successfully deploying this new weapon dramatically increase with each kill roughly we eliminate. For the time being, I have chosen the Hermes as my flagship for the upcoming campaign and transferred additional personnel, fighter squadrons, and warships into this battle group. We will immediately commence operations in the Hyperion system, a significant Kilrathi stronghold on the Terran Kilrathi border that is a major hub for their jump traffic. Meanwhile, our other carriers will invade Freya in a similar operation. Well, we have an admiral on board now? Okay. Welcome to the Galahad Squadron. I'm your new squadron leader, Lieutenant Colonel Jones, callsign Venom. Some of you know me as the ONI officer from the scout, Jim Bowie. I have a very simple chain of command here. I take orders directly from the Admiral, and you take orders directly from me. Viking, Phalanx, Ninja, Avatar, Icefire, Psychopath, Sandman, Assassin, Twilight, Grey Wolf, Problem Child. I'm sure you're well acquainted with your fellow wingmen. I personally requested all of you to transfer into my new squadron. I picked you because I can trust each of you to watch my back. Don't take this lightly. As in my previous line of work, trust is no small matter. We're about to jump into the Hyperion system, but first there's a little house cleaning in order. Our new Excaliburs are jump capable, so we're able to jump into the system without risking any of the task force. There we are to sweep the immediate area and clear it of enemy units. I'm taking in Sandman, Psychopath, and Grey Wolf as Alpha Flight. We'll need to take and hold the jump point until our destroyers arrive to secure it. Then we'll immediately make an advanced three-point sweep of the quadrant to eliminate any welcoming parties the cats have for. The remaining Galahads, Sans Ninja, your fighter apparently has a bug running through the nav system, will sit in as Alert 5, defend the Hermes if this little intrusion gets out of hand. Let's show those cats what the Excalibur fighter can do. We are the best of the best, and those cats are going to find out the hard way. Yee, new toy! Let's see this baby. Yes! Do you see that missile load? Oh, it's amazing. My like downstairs, you don't get the lances, I don't think. Yeah, so. But, since I'm not flying a bomber, and I can actually draw a beat on ships, take some spicks. Ah! Colonel Jones, you and your wing are cleared for launch. Show them all how good our new Excaliburs are. Ooh, new UI too. Oh, so much... Yes. So much better. Hmm. This fighter handles better than a Hellcat. Man could get used to this. Well, I'm glad you're enjoying yourself. Now let's focus. 
I'm expecting a warm welcome on the other side, Galahads. Traffic's all clear to the Hyperion jump point. For you, Sweeney, a warm welcome is a given. Set course to the jump point. Proceed to next waypoint. Wow, that battle group got huge. This is serious business. All right, Alpha Flight, form on the jump buoy and power up jump engine. Man, they are not messing around. Jump in three, two, one. Call sign Venom. Sounds like a guy I would trust, totally. Okay. That looks like a battle group. We're supposed to secure that? Picking up many, many bandits, plus several cap ships in the area. Aw, they rolled out the red carpet. They shouldn't have. Colonel, picking up a tight beam signal from that outpost, she's calling for reinforcement. What's our orders, Colonel? Liquidate everything. Subdued battle music now. I'll take these turrets down first. Hotel group. Huh? Oh, didn't actually want to do that. A lot of sentry guns. It's gonna be oh man, it's gonna take some, some work getting used to handling these things again. Nice. Did the missile hit that thing? That would be amazing. Wow. Tons of firepower in this thing too. Hey! That guy hit me. That's not how this works. I have to tack you on cannons. I guess the Reaper's the other one. You fly like the ape that you are. When he said liquidate everything, did he actually mean the care groups and the outpost? Lazy. Oof, you're actually pretty tough. I guess that makes sense. You're giant stationary, so you don't have to check. All right. That's a lot of ships. Ships ramming speed. That seems like a bad plan. Glide? You totally have glide. Are you auto locking? What the? 
this ship is insanely awesome. Oh, they've launched. They've launched bombers. Their weapons auto converge. You will have to fight this battle, big scum. Break in! Don't get cocky. Anyone can fly this thing and be good in it. Watch out! There's a guy in your six. I will eat your heart. Headbutt. You give us the bolt eye, we'll give you the gun. Like I don't even have to try. Works on shooting uncaptured missiles. That's going to be amazing. I could uh, really use your help over here. This thing is a giant cheat button. <laughs> it's amazing. This is totally going to change everything. They can mass produce this thing? Uh-oh. The handling on this thing, everything on this thing is amazing. I could, uh, really use your help over here. Watch out! There's a guy in your six! How am I not supposed to win with this? This is just like... giant turkey shoes what this is. And it's amazing. This... I don't even have much commentary to make because it's like, shoot guns, win fight. What am I at for kills? 21? Well, I'm even using missiles. Wow, I'm impressed. I could, um, really use your help over here. Father Sweeney, launch all fighters. Launch all fighters! Launch all fighters! I lose a medal for taking everything out before they even get here, before the Hermes even gets here. A lot of fire from this thing, aren't you? Yeah, so let's let's defang you some, shall we? Use your help 
help over here. You know what? You shouldn't be that worried about things. Ping, ping, ping. It's pretty impressive to see. Hermes, welcome to the Hyperion system. The surrounding area has been sterilized. Quite a reception, Colonel. The cats weren't expecting jump capable fighters. Their defenses were lacked. A mistake they'll probably soon rectify. Venom, commence your sweep. We'll hold down the fort. You heard the commander. Proceed to next waypoint. Please, don't make me ever fly anything else except this. Because it's amazing. I don't know why I brought the image racks. There wasn't a point. Heads up, people. We have unfriendlies inbound. Oof, I'm going after one fuel, though. You know what? I'll just let you guys mop this up. I could, uh, really use your help over here. Wow, I'm impressed. This is gonna make me lazy. Like, when they put me in something else that's not, an ex not one of these fighters, I'm gonna miss everything. Even bothering. Thirty one kills in one mission. Kaboom! <laughs> that was quite impressive. Proceed to next waypoint. A Grey Wolf Psychopath. And this new Venom guy and myself, that's quite the... quite the team. Now you shall see a true warrior in battle! Oh right, I don't need Imperial to Imperial Guard. Not for long, at least. I can uh, fly. hi? Imperial Guard? More like Imperial Dweebs. Destroying you will be a pleasure, human! Man. Where's Avatar when you need him? Why do you need Avatar for anything? I shall smash your skull! Headbutt! I like to think it's the headbutt that killed him. We're just smashing through these guys. Wow, I'm impressed. Proceed to next waypoint. It's honestly kind of scary, and if it can mount this system on other fighters like the Arrow, this like this prediction software when it comes to firing primaries, man. Lock and load on the firing line. Enemy ships incoming. I did miss Glide.
fighters have nothing on this ship. They, I mean, they're not even maneuverable enough to avoid the gunfire. This wacko! So, pathetic humans! It dishonors me to engage in battle with one so ignorant! I am Deathbang Norkoxki, Lord of Chaos, and Grandeur of Swift Death! Deathbang, you worthless, flea ridden Utah! I recognized that stench the moment I jumped in! <laughs> It's the hellish ape known as Joe! <laughs> None of my brethren have thought the better of you yet. Unfortunately for you, hell has no vacancies. And that reverence is better lost. I unless he has some unless they have some way to block this auto-targeting stuff, I really don't know how. Death Thing's not going to die in this as easily as the other Vactoths. I really don't. I shall smash your skull! I could, uh, really use your help over here. I have to admit, that was pretty good. I'm impressed. <laughs> Whoa. Lost because of things a tank, I guess? I know you're also kind of invincible at the moment. You're gonna run, aren't you? Okay, well, I'm really kind of ticked at that invulnerable flag now, so I guess we'll see you when I get back to this guy, viewers. See you then. I shall smash your skull! That was a good time to start recording again. We're back, viewers, with Death Fang, our invulnerable friend here. This time I've just brought a bunch of friend or foe missiles, and we're going to clean this up pretty quick. You have won this battle challenge. What?! But I will be back! I That's what you said the last time. Some oak. What happened? I didn't. I shall smash your stuff. I mean, I was holding back specifically, specifically, so that these guys could soften them up. Sir, and they just... we made a big mistake to let him get away like that. Well, Captain, we're not in good enough shape to chase him into whatever backup he's retreating to. Proceed to next waypoint. I was going to dump all those FIFs on him, and it was going to be awesome, and nope. <sighs> Mission complete. What if maybe that was a bug? Colonel Jones, the captain requests your report. We nailed a few picket vessels and a swarm of fighters. 
We also tangled with some Imperial Guard fighters. The 8th Death Bank held their reins. Really? How did our new Excaliburs fare? Galahad's 4, Drakai Imperial Guard, zip. Death Bank bucked the hell out when the odds were turned. I'll forward that on up to Captain Moran. Nice work, Alpha Wing. By far the warmest welcome to an enemy-controlled system I've ever had. You have clearance for landing. That was just weird. Although, that does not dampen my spirits when it comes to how awesome the Excalibur is. So awesome. So cheap. <laughs> but mostly awesome. Great job out there, people. Not only did we get to put the new Excalibur through some extensive combat, we also took down quite a few of their Imperial Drakai pilots. These guys are the best, piloting their best hardware. Another perfect example that the matter of victory isn't in the machine, it's the man who pilots it. We fought the Vaktoth Ace Deathfang today. What you already know is that he's a highly dangerous pilot, Imperial Guard commander, and power-hungry egocentric. What you don't know is that me and him go way back. I've got many reasons, most of it personal, to see him vented into space. Stick with me, listen to what I say, and we'll take him down. We'll be seeing more of him in the future, trust me on this. We've established a foothold into the Hyperion system. The Langley, Ticonderoga, and the 5th Marine Division will stand by till further notice, so for now, we'll be doing the disinfecting of this system. It's going to be intense for the next few days, so I want everyone on their toes. Once more, well done, gentlemen. Dismissed. Yeah, I have no idea what was up with Death Thing now. Bronstar. Three of them. So awesome. Missing quite a few, though. Oh well. My first playthrough, I didn't think I'd get them all. Plus, they might have some crazy requirements. But, again, we just blew up how many other capital ships? We're on a roll. 35 kills. Just like that. Well, viewers, thank you for watching. The Excalibur is awesome, and I really look forward to flying her more. And hopefully that's just what we'll see next time on Let's Play Wing Commander Saga The Darkest Dawn. See you then!